let's talk about it. If you really if you don't choose yourself. If you don't choose yourself, then don't expect anyone else to choose you. Yeah, this is so deep. This is so deep. So, let's talk about it here. So, the act of you choosing yourself sometimes might feel kind of yeah, selfish. Yeah, you some people will think that damn, that person is selfish. That person is so damn selfish. Yeah, but that's it. Sometimes in life you have to be selfish. Because trust me, if you want to be selfish, sometimes you won't even prioritize yourself. You won't even work on yourself. You won't even realize that you have to do something about your life to change yourself to be someone better. So you I'm here to tell you that you should choose yourself. You should first choose yourself because if you really don't choose yourself, they're not going to choose you. I mean, if you don't consider yourself as an important person, who do you do you think other people will consider you as an important person? Do you really think that other people will perceive you as a, a person of higher value if you really don't find yourself as an important person? So it's always that way. This it's always to traffic. If you ha- you haven't noticed, things in this world work that way. There are two-way traffic. I mean, if you do something bad to someone today, something bad is going to happen to you the next day. It cannot be it can be not the next day, but it can be sometimes. You just you are just also going to be paid. So it's always a two-way traffic. So you have to choose yourself. You have to choose you always have to choose yourself. It can be that no matter no matter your relationship, no matter your friendships, no matter no matter whatever th- no matter whatever thing is going on in your life, you always have to choose yourself because you are you and you are re- uh, you are very you are responsible for so many things that you uh, want you han- want them to happen in your life. So you always have to choose yourself. People, some people are going to tell are going to say that hey, uh, this person is so selfish, so selfish because he or she always keep on thinking about him or herself sometimes you know this person always consider trying to improve himself or herself and some people are just going to hate you because you always choose yourself yeah people are going to hate you some people are going to just talk bad about you some people are going to talk shit about you because you fucking choose yourself over them you fucking do the things that actually build you to be a someone else and you don't prefer other people but you prefer yourself you have to choose yourself you have to choose yourself no matter how no matter how things are you always have to choose yourself and if you always choose yourself then you're going to be so happy about yourself you're going to be so happy because if you really don't choose yourself this shows that you actually don't feel good about yourself this shows that you don't find yourself being an important person this shows that you don't value yourself and that is why you don't choose yourself so the moment you don't choose yourself those other people will not choose you will not choose you but the moment you choose yourself you realize that i have to choose me i have to do me because i'm responsible for anything that is go- going to happen in my life i have the pen i have the pen to write whatever i want in my life so you have to choose yourself Some people are going to say, say uh, people some people are going to talk bad about you being uh, choosing yourself. Some people are going to say that hey you are selfish and you really don't care about anyone else but yourself. But you know what? The moment you just don't fo- you don't choose yourself and you choose other people and you focus your attention to them. You you give them too much attention to an extent that you forget about yourself, then you're going to realize that that you, your lifestyle is going to be shit. You're going to flop. You're going to be stressed because you're always going to be doing things that will please them but those things will not please you because you have chosen someone else over yourself so you always have to choose yourself you always have to choose yourself because trust me when it comes to loving yourself let's talk about self love you can't love yourself you can't love yourself if you want to choose yourself so you have to choose yourself love yourself i mean Look at yourself. Are you really capable of giving love to someone else if you really don't love yourself? It's impossible to love someone else better if you really don't love yourself. 
it's impossible for you to care about someone else better if you really don't care about yourself. So the first thing should be always choosing yourself. If you really choose yourself, you consider yourself being an important person and you you focus everything around yourself. You give yourself the attention that that you deserve. You do things that makes you happy. You do things that improve you as a person. You do things that makes you feel spiritually connected, you know, makes you feel alive, makes you feel you are in the present moment and you, you're working towards everything and you're grabbing, you know, it, it, it feels good, you know, it feels good. It feels good. So sometimes you have to choose yourself. You have to choose yourself. You have to do things that will make you happy. You don't have to do things that actually will make you comfortable wherever you are. So you have to choose yourself first. Because if you really don't choose yourself, other people are not going to choose you. Are not going to choose you. Because let me tell you something. If you don't choose yourself, this means you want to be working on yourself. You want to be improving. You want to be, you want to be going places. You'll be stagnant. You'll be stuck. You'll be stuck in your same, ide- uh, same, your same ideologies, your same principles that actually don't improve you. you. You'll be stuck on things that will no- never even push you toward the things that you're actually working on. And if you don't, uh, you don't choose yourself, you won't work on yourself, you won't try to improve yourself, you will, you'll be a shitty person. No one wants to be around a shitty person. You'll be a weirdo. I mean, no one wants to be around a weirdo. People want to be, a, pe- uh, people want to be around people who are who are amazing, people who take good care of themselves. And when you take good care of yourself, actually this reflects to the people who are around you. Someone will look at you, damn, that person is amazing. You know, people will tell, will say that you're amazing because you are taking good care of yourself first. You are amazing. So the, the way you take care of yourself, it reflects to these other people. Other people look at you and say, you know, this person is doing this. This person is tr- always trying to improve himself or herself. And that's why he is so fucking amazing. Let me just be around this person so that I can learn so much from this person. This person seems to be wise. So let me just be around this person so that I can get the knowledge also. Let me just learn the things that this person does so that I can also be like him or her. That will only happen if you choose yourself. Because you're... If you choose yourself, you'll be working on yourself. You'll be doing everything to improve yourself, to be, be to become a better person. And that's it. That you have, you don't have to care about what people will think about you, because as I said earlier, people will say that you're selfish. Some people are going to to say that you're selfish, but other people are going to look at that and say, "Damn, that's an example that we have to copy. We have to look. We have to choose ourselves first before we we think of doing." choosing other people because this means if you choose yourself you'll always be working towards greater relationship you always be working towards greater things in life you'll always be working you'll, you'll always consider you working on yourself first before you do anything and if you work on yourself first th- then this means you'll have better understanding you'll have greater self-awareness about yourself and if you know yourself better then improving yourself is going to be easy Knowing the things that you want to have in your life is going to be easy. And this means the relationship that you're going to create with the other people is going to be super epic. So I'm telling you this. You, ho- you have to choose yourself first. If you want greater things to happen in life, you have to prioritize yourself first. Not to handle yourself first before you think of handling other people. Because you can't tell me that you actually don't love yourself. You don't know how to love yourself. And you expect that you can love someone else better. You, you expect that you can have greater relationship with other people. Yet you don't have greater relationship with yourself. With your inner self. With your inner soul. I mean you really don't have that best relationship with yourself. Don't expect to have a good relationship with other people outside there. So sometimes just be selfish at once. Be selfish at once and choose yourself and focus on the things that actually makes you you. Yeah, sometimes it feels good to choose yourself. Really, it really feels good because choosing yourself is just a way of knowing yourself better. And you will know yourself better. You'll focus on yourself better. The moment you feel comfortable in your own skin, you feel comfortable being you, you feel happy that actually you have chosen yourself. You love yourself. You appreciate yourself. 
you appreciate the weaknesses you have you appreciate you appreciate every mistake of the past that you did and you actually you are happy that you, you tell yourself that um, i am me and i'm so happy to be me and my life is just to always to be to be about me first before i make it uh, make it about someone else when you choose yourself you won't get yourself in toxic relationship you won't get stuck in toxic relationships i mean if you choose yourself the moment someone treats you like this like shit i mean like shit someone doesn't treat you well at all someone doesn't really care about you someone doesn't value you you won't you won't stick to them you won't stick to them anymore you want to stick to that person anymore you'll just walk away from that person because you have chosen yourself you uh, you are pr- prioritizing yourself i mean you are prioritizing prioritizing yourself you find yourself to be an imp- damn important person so you don't want to be hurt you don't want to be in a relationship that someone is going to belittle you someone is going to look at you and say damn you are bad pa-. you you someone is going to look at you and say you are nothing you're always going to choose yourself up so when you in any situation that that makes you feel bad about yourself you always consider your, yourself attaching detaching yourself from that situation because you have chosen yourself but if you don't choose yourself then you won't know your self worth you won't know your value and when someone is treats you like trash you will think that you really have to stick with those uh, with that person because you actually need this person because you really you haven't chosen yourself you actually don't realize even the things that that person is doing are hurting you because you haven't chosen yourself you are pri- prioritizing other people and you don't prioritize yourself so i'm telling you just be selfish for once and try to consider yourself try, just try to just try to think about yourself just have time and reflect on yourself be who and just try to be who you are and work on yourself first before choosing anyone else and something else about choosing yourself because if you if you re- if you choose yourself if you don't choose yourself no one else will choose you when you talk about lower expectations about yourself if you choose yourself if you choose yourself you'll always have high expectations about yourself i mean you know your weaknesses you know your strength you'll always be working toward things that actually are going to improve you make you be a better person make you be a better dad be a better mom be a better friend be a better boyfriend or girlfriend I'm telling you you always have high expectations about yourself because if you choose yourself you'll always be working on yourself first before you do it uh, you do you you help someone else you'll always be trying to love yourself you have love yourself so much before loving someone else we'll always prioritize on things that are going to make you a better person before you think of making someone else a better person and when you are in this stage in this situation then this means you'll have high expectations about yourself because you actually know your value you know your you know your capabilities you know that you know the power you have over the things that you want to have in your life you know you are an amazing person you always have high expectations about yourself and if you have high expectations of of yourself then you'll consider yourself being worthy you'll consider yourself being an important person and you won't let anything uh say the opposite of that you won't let anyone tell you that damn you are not an important person you are trash you are no you won't let that you won't let that and the moment you choose yourself other people will start choosing you trust me if you, you haven't been doing that you haven't been choosing yourself and you actually find yourself that you really don't have friends you don't have great re- relationship with your partner you really don't have uh, anything amazing going on going on in your life change that choose yourself first work on yourself and just see see the results because if you work on yourself there's so many things that you can improve and this improvement is going to reflect outside other people are going to notice that and people who are smart people who actually want to benefit want to know you better want to be around you people will get closer to you because they know you have something to offer yeah trust me people will only be f- friends with the people who will want to be around you if you have something amazing to offer yeah trust me if you are a good person people want to be around you because they know you you can offer love to them you can be 
But if you have nothing to offer because you haven't chosen yourself, you have been choosing other people, no one will want to be around you. You'll, you'll be the needy person. I mean, you'll be the one trying to work to get your way toward these people. You'll be trying to be closer to these people because you find that these people are better because you have chosen them. You, ha you haven't chosen yourself. So you'll be... You'll be always chasing people. You'll be always chasing other people to pull you closer. You'll always want validation from other people. But if you choose yourself, you'll be happy about yourself. You'll know yourself well. You'll, you'll be working on improving yourself. And people will, you'll, you'll be attract, attracting people in your life instead of you being attracted to other people. And the best thing in life is about you being attractive, being attracting other people in your life instead of you being attracted to other people. Yeah, that's it. That's what is going to make you have an amazing relationship with other people. This is what is going to make you have a greater community around you. Because when people are looking at you, they, they say that that person is an, very an important, is very <laughs> an important person. Is an important person. This person loves him, himself or herself. That person always works on improving him, himself or herself. And we should get closer to that person because they'll know that you have great hearts. You are an amazing person. You can always help them also to change their life. Be someone, be, be, be the better people they want to be. So guys, this is what I really wanted to share with you guys. So I'm telling you, just choose yourself if, because if you really don't choose yourself, no one is going to choose you. So thank you so much for watching this video. If you like this video, hit the like button so that the video can spread to other more people out there so that they can work on work on by choosing themselves. And if, you'll, uh, if you're new to my channel and you haven't subscribed, then you know what? Subscribe to my YouTube channel so that you keep on seeing similar content that I'll be publishing in this YouTube channel. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.